Brothers and sisters, bless your energy, brother wisdom, what's going on, guys? All right, um, someone mentioned cloaking, a cloaking device in the last, last, of uh, last one, I was, the last video, I want to build a ship. And um, we're going to talk, we're going to talk briefly about cloaking. How does the cloaking happen? All right. We saw cloaking in the um, in the movie uh, Predator, and we saw this Anunnaki being um, go into a cloak mode and disappear. All right. Um, we know that there are vessels that are in the um, the upper and mid and mid atmosphere that also are cloaking. The whole part of cloaking is high vibrations. All right? This is something that is ancient. This is something that our ancestors had the ability to do. Um, and even mankind cannot explain cloaking, literally. I mean, you gotta understand that they are not real scientists, brothers and sisters. All right? They are like children still learning how to walk. And after 400 something years of being here in existence in this realm, they're still crawling. All right. They're still crawling. They cannot walk, but they want us to walk and not run. Uh, they want us to crawl and not walk. All right. Understand, understand, overstand the methods of our enemies all right they don't want you to know real science all right that's number one this is one thing that i'm I, that, that that myself and osiris were constantly pressing to brothers and sisters science get back into science the scientific approach is the approach to reality all right. Everything else outside of science is religion. And we talked about this before. Everything that's outside of science is religion. Now your shoes, your clothes, your the jobs, the money, the the sports industry, the the pornography industry, the the this industry, that industry, you know, all those are religions. Design. What is religion? Anything designed to hold you back from reality to hold you back to con to uh, consume you to constrain you that's what um, religion is all about and you know religion goes deeper than just the church and the bible all right all the political genre all the other stuff that they're doing that goes beyond so those ships that are cloaking all right, up above us, the way they cloak is that they raise the vibrational energy of the ship. Those ships are made of an etheric metallic substance. Yes, they are made of, of a solid ether, okay? Ether is the only um, metal across the cosmos that has the ability to vibrate at such a high level that it disappears. All right? Ether, I'm going to say it again. Ether is the only metal across the cosmos that when it vibrates at a high rate, an extremely high rate, it disappears. All right? This is why these beings, um, these uh, Saxons and all, they, they can't understand this. Like I said, they're, they're not real sciences. All right? They're placating science. They're, they're acting like they know science, but they don't really know science. All right, ether is something that we have in our bodies, brothers and sisters. 
and we can vibrate at a, such a high level that it would take us to a place of cloaking, disappearing. But you gotta have a high vibrational mind. You have to have your mind open to science. You gotta have your mind open to science. That's why we say we are the most attacked species on this realm. No other species. All these other, all the, it, 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 you, you only have three species. You have the original beings, all right? You have the Orientals, and you have the Saxons. All right, just, just remember that. And the Orientals and the Saxons are not indigenous to the planet. And they're the ones who fight to make sure that we don't return to that true power, or what you call glory. All right, they make they they fight hard to make sure that we don't return to that. All right, so in order for us to be able to link into that if that that energy, we must be highly vibrational. Raise your vibrational energies. We are ether beings. On predator, what was his, what was his body made of? Ether. All right. His body was made of ether. Even though Hollywood had to give, they had to, you know, do that whole thing of making this being um, uh, be killed. Because in reality, that being, that Anunnaki being, could not be killed. In reality, you know, Anunnaki literally controls life and death when it comes to their bodies. <laughs> Seriously. All right, so um, those those uh, ships that are in mid mid atmosphere, high atmosphere, very little of them, very little of them are in low atmosphere, but they um, they are made of an ether, metallic ether. All right, and this is this is what their ship is made of. And it cannot be found on this planet at all. And these inorganic beings, they cannot touch this ether material because it's, it's it, it alone. I mean, you can you can not have ether, this 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 ether, this ether metal connected to anything. And its vibrations are so high when you touch it, your vibrations rise. And when they touch it, that's why they have to use machines because if they touch it with their hands, the vibrations are so high that their bodies literally dissipate because they're not designed for this. But if any of us touch these vessels, brothers and sisters, I mean, our bodies will, the, the energies of our bodies will raise so high, which is why when you know you have these ships or whatever that that come down or whatever or these parts these old parts that they have they don't want us to touch these uh, uh vessels because they know what these vessels do for us they know the, the 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 magnitude of what these how these vessels operate so know that your enemy knows so much more about you than what you know about yourself but at the same time they're not real scientists all right like we said, they are literally crawling, trying to walk. They want us to walk and not crawl. I mean, I'm sorry. They want us to crawl and not walk. They want us to crawl and not walk at the same time. They, if, if we start walking, they want to make sure that we're not running because they don't want, they, they, they are literally in a, in a state of competition and we're not in a state of competition. We're not competing with anybody. We're just trying to raise our vibrations and return to the source of power that we belong to. That's all we're doing. We're working hard to, to return to that source, to return to that energy. That's all we're doing. We're like, hey, this is where we belong. This is what we're supposed to be doing. You know, this is where, this is, this is how we're supposed to be operating. This is, this is, I mean, it's, it's a, it's a natural occurrence for us. But we have an enemy who wants to make sure that we don't return to that natural occurrence. Because naturally, we're supposed to be able to vibrate. Before the fall, these beings had so much, so much hard times fighting us because we could disappear and reappear. Just like you see on the movie Dragon Ball Z. And he'd be up in the air and he'd disappear 
and then reappear somewhere else because he's in a state of levitation. That's that ether. And this is what we are made of. But you have to remember, we had the structures around us. We had the system on our planet created so that we could be in that state. That's why we talk about we have to build. That's why we talk about we have to create. That's why we have to talk. We talk about we have to bring ourselves back because you got to understand, understand, overstand the, the, the natural balance of who we are and how we are supposed to operate. We are far more powerful than what you can imagine, brothers, sisters, and, 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 and we're just literally we are we are baby we are we're spoon feeding you all because we would give you guys the grand pieces many of you would just like i'm ready i'm ready i'm ready so it's like you gotta get you you gotta spoon feed you but the cold cloaking thing the the the, the material is made of ether what is this made of ether what is this ether what is this ether what is all that? Ether. We're nine ether beings, high ether beings. Nine is going to be the highest on, on, on the physical level. We're the highest on the physical level, which means that we can operate in the highest capacity of, the, uh, 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 of cosmic energies. You understand, understand, overstand what we're coming from, brothers and sisters. So those cloaking devices... What do they do? They they turn that device on and it and they cloak and it's vibrating at such a high rate. You can't see it. The whole ship just disappear. The ship disappears and they're up there doing whatever and they have ships coming in and out, in and out. You don't even know that there are ships that are cloaked that are going in and out of these huge, these colossal vessels up there. There are ships going in and out, in and out, bringing their reports, doing all kind of other things, whatever they have to do. And I'm not going to talk about what they're doing because it's, 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 it's not the business of these Saxons and, 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 and um, uh, Orientals to know. It's not, it's not their business to, to know. But they're these vessels, they're going in and out. They're going in and out. They're doing what they got to do. All right. Our job is to raise our vibrations, but we have to build as well. You have to build the energy and power that you need. Therefore, you can be able to create anything because your vibrations are extremely high. All right. Your, your vibrations are extremely high and you when with, with extremely high vibrations, it takes you into a, a, a state of mental competence when you're competent of everything that is going on around you. All right, brothers and sisters. So I pass this on to you. All right. I, I, I hope you understand this. I hope you take this in. I hope you consume this. I hope you 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 you, you bring this into your aura so that you can be in a completely different state of energy and power all right we've got to return brothers and sisters we got to return so the whole cloaking devices these these ships are made of a very powerful ether that's more powerful than this ether here far more powerful you're talking about some freaking i'm not even going to go into the numbers because the numbers is is, it's not even necessary to go into but here on our realm, we can do outstanding, amazing. Oh, my goodness. I can't even make the words up that we can do because this we can do it. We can we can do this, brothers and sisters. So the whole key point is for us to be high vibrational. That's why we're going through all the meditations. That's why you're going to get all the lessons. And this is why you're getting all the information on science, building, creating, designing, structuring, architects, architect, architectural stuff, learning. We're going to we talk about the sounds, the, 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 the frequencies. And, you know, that's that's the whole part. So your vibrations arises. Why? Because your frequencies are up. Your frequencies are up. Why? Because you're thinking on a higher level. When, you, when you're in a consistent manner of thinking on a higher level, not saying that you're not going to laugh and joke around, you know, because this is what we do all over the cosmos. We laugh and joke around. We're not all serious all the time, but we are about our business. And this is what we got to be about. We got to be about our business. That's why we talked about these inorganic beings with all the shit that they got going on, all these spells, all the shit that they're doing is designed for us. 
and us only. It's designed for us and us only to keep our vibrations, our frequencies low so that we can be a part of their system and not be a part of the system that we're supposed to be a part of, which is the cosmic order, which is the order of nature. Okay, brothers and sisters, I pass this on to you. I hope you understand, understand, overstand everything that's been said. All right. I got to get my little 30 minute workout. All right. I catch you guys later. You know the deal. All powerful. All power <laughs> to the multi chakra celestial angelic beings. May chaos reign with you forever and ever and ever. And remember, chaos is knowledge. Chaos is wisdom. Chaos is change. Chaos is everything that bring that that destroys a low frequency system to bring things back to balance. And when chaos is finished and chaos has raised everything back up to where it's supposed to be, then there will be peace. All right. Much power to you all.